Come on in. Basically, when we came up with Central, Devin and I, uh, we wanted something that was really comfortable, um, something that was homey and cozy. you could just cozy. Cozy was huge. Like our big tagline is uh, "Your neighborhood local." But yeah, homey was the big thing. Cozy, uh, where you could come, you know, multiple times a week and just have a good beer and some great food um, and just hang out with your friends. You know, a lot of the elements that we had with, with design basically was a lot of wood, uh, brick, metal, um, basically anything you would see that just spells comfort. You know, and, and so sitting at the bar, you know, we have some. Uh, great beers on tap. Our tap selection is a little limited, yeah. uh, but we focus basically on uh, domestic tap and craft tap. Okay. Um, so two crafts, uh, Vernon BC is represented, Oliver BC is represented uh, with the fire hall stout from Oliver and then a pale ale from... I like uh, the, it's an actual fire hall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's well, awesome. a buddy of mine I graduated with actually, uh, he started the fire hall brewery. Okay. Um, yeah, basically, so he started it in uh, five or six years ago yeah. uh, in his dorm room actually. So I told him, if, yeah, no word of a lie, Two, three years ago, I said, if we ever opened a restaurant, I'm going to carry your beer, uh, and it doesn't hurt that it's excellent. So uh, that's what we have on tap. And then another focus is our wine on tap. Okay. And we're representing the Okanagan again with Hester Creek from Oliver, and oh, then. I love uh, Hester Creek. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, then Blast, awesome. Blasted Church from yeah. OK Falls as well. Yeah, so. Awesome. And you guys have some pretty good specials on. And yeah, I mean, we're, I think we're becoming known for our specials. And your guys' menu. You guys have some. I know for me, like, I tried your guys' fries, and that yeah. was like. <laughs> I, I, I can smell them right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, what yeah. kind of uh, items on the menu do you have that are... Uh, well, everything's fresh. So the great thing about what we do here is that we cut our own fries in-house, we make all of our own sauces in-house, uh, we grind our own burgers, we butcher our own steaks. Um, oh, you do? Yeah, everything everything, oh, wow. everything we do in-house. And we, yeah. it, we, we find it, um, it obviously adds to the value. Yeah. Um, the freshness is in the food. Um, and that's what we have. You know, it's a, a familiar uh, favorites with a bit of a twist. So. And you guys have sports on TV and in, in TV. Always. Yeah, I mean, the, the idea was to have a a dual kind of uh, space, a space where people could have like a destination spot for great food, great drinks, um, but also have a space for sports. It is a, a sports bar uh, element of it. So we have like, you know, we had the great Seahawks game on Sunday, which is awesome in here. Uh, volleyball tonight, we have ball hockey, basketball, um, trying to marry the food, social uh, culture uh, in Kelowna, yeah. And it's kind of a hidden spot because if you're driving by it, you know, it's just a little kind of hidden Well, that's, what's, that's what's cool about it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like the, the, the the element of surprise was big for us. Creating a bit of a cult following and a local following right. um, was what we wanted to do. You know, kind of similar to Gastown or Yale Town in Vancouver. That's what it feels like. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So something like limited signage. Uh, we want word of mouth to really spread, um, and we want. Looks like it's working out for you guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, we're very. Um, I don't know. Devin and I are very fortunate and grateful uh, yeah. to everybody in Kelowna that has supported us because you know we've spent the last decade in this industry in Kelowna, um, and we've developed a great network of people that have uh, been really, really eager to check us out and just see what we're about. And the opportunity to be creative and offer something to the community has been, uh, it's been awesome.